Chers collègues, les syndicats font face aux défis plus grands depuis des décennies. Unions face their greatest challenges in decades. American public sector unions are fighting strips to collective bargaining rights in 20 states, strips to pensions in many, many more. Here in Ontario, the Liberal government is poised to make public transit an essential service, while union locals in Brantford, Welland, Timmins and Hamilton have been on strike or locked out for as long as five years. And Tim Hudak? Well, Tim Hudak promises to fix the interest arbitration system by placing caps on salary rulings. We in OSSTF FESO may soon find ourselves fighting for our basic rights in this precarious time. A time in which we face an unsure political landscape and an uncertain bargaining climate. When public sector pension envy is at an all-time high. A time of continued inadequate government funding and issues of workplace safety, declining enrollment, potential workplace closures, and job security. These are challenging times in which OSSTF FESO needs experienced, effective leaders. Leaders who can quickly analyze complex issues and work with others to develop smart, strategic actions that focus on reaching our goals while keeping us united and strong. I believe I have shown I am such a leader. In the early 1990s, I was a grid teacher and sole income parent when my third year salary was cut by 5% and then frozen for three years. <laughs> I experienced firsthand the anxiety of this difficult time for public sector workers. This experience deepened my conviction that unity in the face of adversity and solidarity among workers are essential. I fought for funding for the full service adult day school, was a marshal during the days of action, picket captain on the Bill 160 lines, implemented the first selective service withdrawal strike in our union and stared down an intransigent employer and provincial government as chief negotiator of the only education worker bargaining unit in Ontario without a collective agreement under the PDT timeline. Fighting to maintain solidarity and to protect publicly funded education, education workers and our rights as a union is basic to who I am. C'est fondamental pour moi. Experience has taught me that to protect our members, to achieve our collective priorities, and to establish a context for successful bargaining, we must ensure we have well-trained, confident local leaders, and we must engage in ongoing political action which is proactive, strategic, and pragmatic with an end goal of ensuring access to and influence with key government decision makers. Local leaders should be provided with the tools and resources necessary to maintain an ongoing dialogue with their local politicians, building on election campaign involvement and lobby day successes. In addition to being politically astute, we must make sure members are ready to take action in support of achieving our collective priorities. To ensure this, communication with members in all forms must reflect that their priorities form the basis of what we do. Whether in bargaining, political action, fighting for our pensions, or to protect our working conditions, we are in this together. These issues have impact on each of us in this room and on every single one of our members. This is true whether we work in the smallest bargaining unit in OSSTF or the largest, whether we are from an urban setting or rural, francophone or anglophone, support staff or teacher. While each district and bargaining unit is distinct with its own culture and challenges, it is my deepest conviction, born of two decades of OSSTF FESO activism and leadership, that when we focus on what we share in common, we are stronger for it. On est plus fort lorsqu'on tient compte des choses qu'on a en commun. Over the past 20 years, you have come to know me as a strong, effective leader, open listener, and strategic thinker. I am someone who understands the importance of the full service school and the education team, who communicates clearly and effectively, 
With your support, it is this set of skills and experience that I will bring with me to our provincial executive team and put to work on behalf of all our members. Thank you. Merci.